Uh, here's from Twitter. Any progress on restarting the U.S. security assistance? Some of these we can make rather short. No, uh, no, I never asked uh, for any assistance. Okay. Um, <laughs> also from, Ask for understanding, not assistance. Also from Twitter, what's an ideal Kashmiri solution from the Pakistan perspective and one that you believe the Pakistan people will accept? I think it should not be the Pakistani people anymore. It should be what the people of Kashmir want. And, and that really is the only solution. What do the people of Kashmir want? And, and a I would like to uh, have a relationship as equals of friendship, not as it has been before, that where Pakistan has sort of been, you know, it's like Pakistan wanting aid from the US, and then as for aid, Pakistan is expected to do certain things. And, you know, if someone asks that, will you get this fund? I hate the idea that we would be asking for funds, not U.S., from anyone. Because this is, aid has been one of the biggest curses for my country. What it has done is, what it has done is, it has created the dependency syndrome. We have become, you know, uh, I, when I went on my first trip to Saudi Arabia, I came back, what have you got from there? As if I'd gone there to beg for money. And I think it's humiliating for a country. Countries rise because of self-respect and self-esteem. No countries rise by begging and borrowing for money. So my relationship with the U.S. would be, uh, I would like a relationship with, uh, a dignified relationship with the U.S. where, uh, Never again should we ever have this, this that humiliating phase. I can tell you as a Pakistani, never did I feel more humiliated when Osama bin Laden was taken out in Pakistan by the U.S. Uh, uh, troops. Never did I feel more humiliated because uh, here was a country which was supposed to be an ally and our ally did not trust us. So as a Pakistani, it was for every Pakistani it was humiliating. We never want to be in that same position again. We want to have a relationship of friendship. And it doesn't matter, you know, friend can be rich and the other can, can not be so rich. But so what? You, you know, it's, it's about a dignified relationship and that's what I hope to have. To be here. I'd like to present you with a small token of our appreciation for your visit Thank here. You, uh, invite you to come back and wish you all the best. Please join me in thanking the Prime Minister. Thank you.